What is up guys, we are here with some Watchdog Legions on the PS5. Um, I'm really excited to bring this gameplay to the channel. Uh, let's let's get that reward while we're at it. Um, funny enough, I've played Watch Dogs and Watch Dogs 2, but not all the way through. So you're gonna see like, it's like, oh yeah, like you earned the reward for playing Watch Dogs, you know, all that good stuff. But it's like, you know, I, I kind of didn't. See, I already claimed these on the PS4 when I got it. I kind of find it weird that that they're like letting you go back on collected, I guess. But all right, let's exit that and get back to the game. Online launches December 2020. I know we're looking forward to that. And let's just do this uh, new game for it. Uh. I don't know, does like permadeath won't be active until the mission reporting for duty is I guess that makes it more in oh uh, wait, 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 let me turn that on. <laughs> Let's just have permadeath be on so when we lose uh an agent we lose him for good. It's funny when PS5 was like, yeah, there's gonna be no more loading screens and then here we are with the a loading screen. <laughs> Completing a bureau uprising reveals, blah, blah, blah. Okay, you see attack hack on a throne. Dang, that's like way too fast for me to read. Ah, oh, London, what a town. History around every corner and a tourist photographing it. Pubs serving up a pint and a smile. All that music, theater and art and multiculturalism. And the world's oldest underground, the tube. The class of cities, really. Top shelf stuff. Only took 12,000 years to build it up, and one night to tear it all down. our status perimeter security's down but plenty of your flying friends about Fucking hell. dalton no time to waste yes ma'am Ever consider leaving these security threats to the authorities? <laughs> well, it's rich, Bradley. The government would sooner arrest us for trying to help than actually do something useful. Let us all this one on our own. Carefully, Dalton. Bradley, are you detecting a little worry in Sabine's voice? Brilliant. Asking the computer about feelings. This explains so much. Shut it, you two, and get to work. There she is. in this system that hurt you more than it hurt me do us a favor and keep it quiet Dalton if they don't shoot me I won't shoot let me them. close that How's just that? in case press circle you can go up against the wall I'll see how I can play this safe Trying to see uh, who's all here. <laughs> Trying 
trying to be as sneaky as possible. Sneaking is not like my forte when it comes to games. I actually like hate sneaking. I'd rather be like a running gun. And why do you suppose that is? What? How did they get their hands on it? I don't know. But someone wants to make it look like Deadset was here. Shit. You need to proceed with extreme caution, Dalton. Who are these men in black anyway? Nothing identifying. I suspect that's by design. Oh, fuck me. The entire place is rigged to blow. Jesus, those canisters. Backley, is that... RDX nitrogen. Enough to level Parliament. Can you locate a detonator, Bagley? Not exactly, but there's a device streaming a fuckload of encrypted data from the floor above you. Yeah, that fits the bill. On my way. Yeah, we throwing hands out here, fam. What you thought this was? <laughs> I've staged dead sec propaganda all around the bombs. These pricks are gonna blow up Parliament and hang it on us. Not if you get to that detonator first. Yeah, we will try. Oh look, no technology needed. Let me just kick it. There we go. What is that movie called? Is it uh The Kingsman? This is what Legion, at least the story right now, kind of reminds me of. It's like being uh, a UK uh, secret agent. Okay, deactivate the detonator. Let's do this. I found the detonator. And it's definitely live. Bagley, I'm gonna need some help with this. Yes, you are, but sadly, I'm locked out. Fuck. Well, we don't have a chance without Bagley. Wait, I might know a workaround. We trained your manual overrides at MI5. You're full of surprises. Be quick about it. All right, Bagley, do your thing. I'm in. And the bombs have just armed themselves. Uh oh. oh that may complicate matters. Yeah, that is not good at all. Can you defuse them or not? Of course I can. But I might also trip another fail safe and vaporize you. So, fair warning. I expect this to draw some attention your way, Dalton. Oh, I'm counting on you. Company at our back door. Shit. Dalton, we've got some heat here at HQ. How long is this going to take, Bagley? Depends how often you interrupt me with questions. All right, everyone. Faces on, guns out. It's about to get real. Fuck. All right, let's see how we're gonna how we're gonna play this one out. They're on me. I'll try and hold them off. At least we put a mask on. <laughs> Come out wherever you are. Clear. Heading out. Bagley, update. Let's just say I'm both impressed and annoyed by how sophisticated this anti-tamper security is. Still working. No. Bagley, tell me you're close. I'm through security. Now wading through terabytes of decoy code looking for the detonation sequence.
That turns way more than what I want it to. Yeah, I need to change up the sensitivity on the stick. I don't mind if I do. Who's wrong? There are three slots on the left. One of them is the receiver. You need to pull the controller wire. Are you fucking kidding me? No, I'm fucking not. Pull the wire. If this gets me blown up. That's quite a quite an AI right there. See? That wasn't so bad, was it? Ugly, you bastard. You're gonna give me a bloody heart attack then. <laughs> <laughs> uh oh. Well, what the fuck am I looking at? It appears Parliament is not the only target. More bombs are going live as we speak. On screen, badly. You know, we need to get the word out. Those sites need to be evacuated. They're spread out all over London. There isn't any time. But my sister's at the town conference. We have to do something. I picked up a transmitter on the roof that is sending out a signal to the other bomb sites. If you can reach it, I can shut it all down. Sabine! Fuck! Dalton, we're breached! Go! The roof! Okay, yeah, I was like, how do you sprint Sabine, again? What's going on? We're being raided. It's a bloodbath. Her protocol is to wipe everything, including badly. I need him for the transmitter. I know, but if they get him, they get everything. Names, opt, locations. Okay, I'll do it the old-fashioned way. Wipe him. Yes, wipe me. Okay, so do yeah, we can hop into there. all this different Fuck. technology. I thought. Dalton, if this or maybe it's just the door I have to face, right? I'll see you at the rally point. I promise. Good luck. Okay, we just have to download the key. Boom. Uh, I guess I can leave out of this thing. Yep. Because then I can get in this door. A headshot. Come on. <laughs> Oops. Oh, okay, I was like, why can't I hack it? Exactly. 
to save the world. You do know Londoners have died before. Hmm? The plague, the Great Fire, the Blitz. There's not much fun. But destruction is always the cure. And it begins today. Zero day. God dang. Going ham with these explosives. It's time for a hard reset. Oh my god. Well, that's a nice little setup. Explosions devastated three sites in London. Authorities are asking residents to remain in their homes as the situation continues to develop. Stay in our homes. No like random locations are blowing up, bro. Mourners gathered for a series of candlelight vigils that brought closure to thousands of families and indeed to an entire city. London is now laser. Downing Street, where Nigel Cass, CEO of private military company Albion, received a mandate to secure London. Cass has vowed to hunt down dead set terrorism responsible. Albion used cutting edge artificial intelligence systems and autonomous drones to capture the remaining members of dead set. A stark warning to would be insurgents. Operations are posting record profits due to increased efficiencies in production and distribution. Enabled by the use of technologies initially developed and approved for security purposes. It's a long overdue cleanup as crime numbers take a dive. Illegal gambling, drug trafficking, and prostitution all down following prosecutions of the leaders of four of London's five largest criminal syndicates. The streets of Camden and Brixton. As Albion's mandate is extended indefinitely by the government, life finally begins to return to normal. Curfews and travel restrictions have been lifted in all boroughs thanks to the deployment. Fake news outlets, reports of rioting in Trafalgar Square have been greatly exaggerated, possibly by foreign meddlers pushing a false narrative through social media. Albion is in complete control of a new reprimand the public about the circulation of fake news. Conspiracy theories persisting in dark corners of the internet that terrorist group Deadset were framed for the bombings have been roundly rejected. Our own reporters could not find a single Londoner willing to expound those theories on camera. But it's like, why would DeadSec try to hurt the public? They've always been about helping. You know? I need to assemble a team, but I can't reboot DeadSec alone. Let me break into London CTOS and see who's available. Okay, so we hijacked in the, the spider. Now alleged terrorist group, DeadSec. On this week's Buccaneer Radio, I have Colin calling in. Colin, what's oh, your take? This is the one. Now, yep. <laughs> from the start, we should have round up dead sick and thrown them in jail. Now, I'll say they should all be lined up and shut. You don't find it awfully convenient that they've been fingered as the attackers, but we've seen no proof. Look at Joe! Look at our city! What more proof do you need? Look at our well, city! Colin, I'd say you have to look at their history of non-violent action. Albion's put more civilians in the hospital in the past few months than dead sick ever has. I smell a scapegoat. Now I have Emily calling in. Emily, what's your take? You're absolutely right, Claire. The government's just framing dead sex because they want to make it seem like they have this under control. They probably have no clue who was behind the bombings. But that doesn't look good on the news, does it? Dead sex being a thought. Really hoping you guys end up enjoying this series. I do want to play Legion online and for the campaign as well and see all that it has to, to give. The Primer Death feature is pretty cool for this. So I'm really looking forward to that. That was all three that we had to, to lift up, I believe. Next, I have Quinto King. Do you feel safer using a pseudonym? Everyone should. 
Boom, there we go. Just putting out the signal. Shit. Situation is worse than I thought. Uh, but there's a candidate. Deceased, deported. Looks like your dead sex best hope. Alrighty. So, one of the cool things is like, you get to choose between the... The list here, um, as far as I can tell, it seems kind of like randomized each time because on PS4, I had different options here and then they each come with like their, their own perks. So like this person physically fit, so she'll take less damage. Fake creates fake coupons so you can get clothes discounted, huh? As a private phone line to police commissioner, so shorter team arrest time. To summon a drone. Shorter team injury time. 6G data plan, fast download. That's really good. I wish you could customize them though, because like, I don't know. I, it's like, I like that fast, like fast hacking short. We have like shorter cooldowns, but I also like, uh, what was it? Someone had like the drone, but I don't like how they really look per se. I'm just going with the doctor, Jackie Palmer, and we'll see how that goes. They call me Doctor, Doctor Blades, with a Z. Excuse me, sir. You are in front of my Glad vehicle. You're alive. If you're still committed to the cause, DedSec needs you. I'll send you the coordinates to our last safe house. Auto Take drive now enabled. Right. So you can put on auto drive. Auto but now like does it take you to to where you want to be or do you have to yeah i want to track that set that as my waypoint and like will it auto drive there now huh. it just might it actually like makes you drive like like a good citizen should be driving but let's try to see if we can get there faster. Uh, I can't even get past these ones. I'll just cut it to when we're actually there, guys. All right, guys, looks like we're finally here. So let's uh, get out of the car and hurry on in. a patch to your optics so you can access our security system it's set up so that i can't just let someone who isn't dead sec in you will have to do the manual override that's as long not as too difficult oh snap my boy got an accent out here just to make sure this we're not getting in troubles out here the boy not ready And yep, got in. That was pretty quick and easy. Let me see. Wish me luck. <laughs> I had no idea he was gonna have an accent like that. I was expecting a British accent, but then he was out here like, you know, brother, I'm out here doing the hacking and the slashing and the stealing and the wheeling. Uh, Cause that's totally not creepy down there. Hello, anyone there? I better get the power back on. Okay, now I don't hate my decision. I, I actually love my decision for who I chose. <laughs> now it's just going to suck if I end up dying with him. I don't want to die with him now because I, I love that accent. <laughs> what are these? You can listen to this stuff? No they can pick them up. 
Identify yourself, or I'll seal the exits, hack your optic, and read you every drunken email you ever wrote until you starve. Sabine sent me. I'm a friend. Sabine's alive? Well, that's one piece of good news. I'm Bagley, DedSec's definitely not stolen, highly advanced AI assistant, and it seems I've been out of commission for a few months. Not stolen. Anyway, why don't you go connect me to the DedSec network so I can become more powerful than you could possibly imagine? I mean, catch up on what I missed. That's a floppy disk. There's something in here too. I'm just going to pick these up before I end up forgetting, because I tend to do that when I'm recording. I'll forget that I was going to go back and pick certain items up. Yep, got to go up here. To the upload. In this episode, we're talking about CTOS 3.0, the city operating system that's now powering all of London. For those of you who need reminding, as if anyone does at this point, CTOS... Ah, that's it. I'm reconnected to the network, downloading our database, news archives, and... Oh, oh, oh no. Terrorist group DedSec responsible for deadly bombings in London. Dalton Wolf dead? I leave you people alone for a second and you immediately cock it all up. Who could be Sorry. enough to set DedSec up for the bombings? There's a gap in my memory after Dalton, well, let's be honest, after I disarmed the bomb at Parliament. I'm missing information about what happened after I was taken offline. But from what I can infer, an unknown hacker group identified only as Zero Day was involved. I believe this Zero Day staged the attacks and framed DedSec for their dirty work. Come to my terminal. Sabine is requesting a video call. Okay. Let's do this contact real quick. Patching in Sabine Brandt now. I suggest you listen very closely to anything she has to say. There you are. I'm glad you oh, made whoa. it. Backley. God, it's good to hear your demented little voice. Is your memory intact? Not even slightly. The last record I have is of our HQ being raided. My only lead is a group known as Zero Day. Ring any bells? No. But the HQ was attacked by some men in black, the same that were at Parliament, maybe working together. We didn't stand a chance. They just gunned everyone down. Well, Ross Clark, I'm glad you're still with us. I managed to escape through the sewers to Camden. A contact smuggled me out of the city, and I've been hiding out in the north since. Prudent. Your profile is red flagged as a high priority target in the city's surveillance system. Even a partial recognition here would have you hunted down and shot on sight. Listen to me. As far as London is concerned, DedSec is responsible for the bombings. And anyone still working for them is persona non grata. Listen, if anyone knows anything about risks, it's me. I lost everything. You and better tell him, doctor. But I can't tell him, doctor. This. London is in a death spiral. But we are DedSec. And if DedSec can't pull it out, trust me, no one can. The city needs a resistance. And it starts with you. What do you say? Well, sometimes you have to do what's right. Excellent. New user registered. Welcome to DedSec. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Now, it would be irresponsible of us to release you naked and mewling into the wild. You'll find equipment around the safe house that are essential items in your DedSec kit. Alrighty, so... Guess we'll pick all that up. So we got tech points, but you have to find throughout the city and you can use that to upgrade your gadgets and weapons and equip it all on. Touchpad, and then we can choose between an AR cloak, augment reality cloak, or the infiltrator spider bot. Uh, capable of performing non-lethal takedowns. Um, I think I want to, yeah, I think I want to try out this AR cloak. That'll be dope. Edit the loadout. That's our weapon. And then we can equip on our gadget. We have a sophisticated system for hiding your identity from facial recognition tech. It's called a mask. And while we're wow. here, perhaps we can talk about updating your wardrobe. I mean, look at you. Come on. Alrighty, so got the wardrobe and huh. Let's just go look at the masks. I think I like this one the most. Yeah, I'll stick with that. 
try to see if there was like anything really for us to look at. It doesn't look like it. Uh, we don't care for like the outfit per se. You've got all these fancy new toys, but it's also important to know the basics. You need to learn how to throw a punch and how to take one. Albion will escalate if you come at them with a gun and shoot you down. We want to avoid collateral damage. In DedSec, we try to use guns only as a last resort. Have you already met Connie Robinson? She owns the pub and is an old DedSec contact, not to mention a champion amateur boxer. Go to the practice ring and she'll show you how to stop flinching when someone cocks a punch at you. Okay, yeah, it wants us to fight, but guys, I'm going to leave this video off right here. Next time, we're going to head over to the boxing ring and get our combats on. Hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure you leave a like for the video. It helps out the video a lot, and also subscribe to my channel. It helps out the channel a lot. Let's me know you enjoy the content you see right here. But with that said, guys, stay sharp. Later.